Okay, so we have our next three by three up, <laughs> and I can already tell who this is. Wait, really? I, I, I'm, I'm pretty confident. Okay. I'm pretty damn confident. So we got Hunter Hunter 2011, I assume. Yu Gi Oh, uh -huh. Dragon Ball Z, Code Geass, Attack on Titan, Jujutsu Kaisen, Death Note, Vinland Saga. What's that last one? Code Geass. Oh, it's Code. Why did yeah, they pick I that think picture? That's yeah. No, Code Geass is up there. So what's that one? That is. What is that? What's the last one? That is Code Geass. <laughs> that looks like Lelouch and that looks like the Zero Mask. I don't know what that is. Oh, Cashurn Sins? Cashurn! Oh my God, I have no that. What's so Cashurn? Long. Huh? The fuck is Cashurn? Uh, Cashurn Sins is the beta code. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I, wouldn't, I wouldn't go that far. Um, is this Charlie's I'm list? pretty confident it's yeah, Charlie's it's one. Gotta, yeah. This is the most a male anime fan oh. generic list ever. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. <laughs> <laughs> that makes sense. Not a single romance or, or no, slice of life everything, to be seen. Not a single sports anime. Everything is action, manly stuff. Yeah, I fucking men. It. I it. Men, 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 men. Boys, boys, boys. boys. This, <laughs> this is, is the boys this, only Is this Charlie's? Club. Yeah, this yeah, is Charlie's. Be. What's, be. what's the bottom right one? Oh, it is Cash yeah. and Sins. Wow, he watched Cash and Sins? What the yeah. fuck is Cash and Sins? I don't even know what this is. It, did it come out before or after? I, th I can't remember. It's it it, before, right? It is an action anime. That's all was, I really know about what, it. What I, I didn't watch it. I didn't actually watch well, it. I haven't watched it in years. Um, uh, I think it might be kind of like- It's a mecha, I'm pretty sure. So 7.5 on Mal, that is literally the most seven, like that means it's <laughs> like a five out of 10. <laughs> but one thing that I, I am guessing why Charlie put this on is that it just has a very badass art style and a very badass visual kind of like identity. And it's true. Uh, which, you know, I know Charlie would be a big fan of. Does Charlie have a reason for putting cash and sins in? No. Mm. All right. Well, I mean, okay. Let's let's go. Let's yeah. go through this. Even though this <laughs> screams, this already screams. Code everything. Yes makes sense because he said on Trash Taste that that's his favorite anime of all time. Oh, that's valid. Which is I, valid. I can see why yeah. someone would be their yeah. favorite. I know you went through a phase of collecting Yu-Gi-Oh cards as yep. well. Yep. So yeah. Yu-Gi-Oh is just great. I just love the memes. I just love the, I don't know, the Yu-Gi-Oh fandom seems like they have a good time. It's so quotable as well. It's such a great show. <laughs> you're a, well, The dub is great. You're a, what, the dub you're, is so you're good. a third rate duelist. No, you're a fourth rate duelist with a th third rate deck or something. <laughs> I love see, that the problem with the dub is that I don't know, like I literally can't tell which scenes are from the original dub and which scenes are from Yu-Gi-Oh! Abridged. I think, I think that one I just quoted is from the Abridged, actually. <laughs> so I think the, no, it should have been me. I think that's from the I think that's bridge. from the dub. That's from the original. Is it? Oh, no, no, no. Fuck. It should have been I me, not know. him. I that's from the original anymore. dub. I don't fucking know anymore. But dude. I keep quoting like- Well, the Abridged- My deck has no pathetic cards, Yugi, which I think is from Yu-Gi-Oh! Abridged. <laughs> yeah. if I, and then if, obviously the <laughs> fucking Pot of Greed meme is oh, all from yeah. the- the, that's the from, fucking that's from the abridged. Reed. Yeah, yeah, that's from like, which one? Pot of greed. They're like, what does pot of greed do? And like, no one ever. No one knows. No one knows what pot of greed does. Oh no, I I think that just became a meme because every time pot of greed came on, pot of greed came on, they would always explain the power, even though it was the most simple card you could possibly pull from the deck. Now, wasn't it like, it was like that you explain how Pot of Greed works by using Pot of Greed or something? Yeah. yeah. And, then really, I'll, and then I summon another Pot of Greed. I, I, I unfortunately have no idea which memes, yeah, like you said, come from the abridged yeah. and which come from the actual dub. I have have, you, so have you noticed Pot of Greed is basically just every ugly bastard fucking design you've yep. seen from Hentai? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it, it is kind of confusing yeah. and kind of concerning. Yeah, look, look at this shit, it's, man. It's my favorite fucking card, bro. Yeah. Pot Can we agree greed. that the Look at Look that. At, it's that smile, man. <laughs> <laughs> you saw saw it and got turned on and thought, hold on now. <laughs> Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh, we, actually, we can I put have this... an actual pot of greed. That's actually kind oh, of badass. That's, I that's want really, that. really sick. I, I, I think the dual disc is probably the, you just the draw hardest, two cards, right? Yeah. The hardest piece of equipment in all of all time. It goes so hard. The what? The sorry? dual disc. Oh, the, the fucking the, coolest yeah. piece of uh, anime merchandise. Every that you can kid, own. Yeah. every kid. That's just so one. iconic having yeah. one. I, I had one as a kid. You did? Yeah, oh, I, I couldn't. I couldn't get my parents to buy me one. I wanted yeah. one of these so bad when I was a kid. Holy! It fuck. was so sick, but I remember it, it was so annoying having to keep your arm like <laughs> up all the time while you're playing. Yeah. But it, it felt so fucking badass that you didn't even mind. I. What a cool piece of equipment. That is the coolest card game, kind of like 
piece so of equipment sick. that has ever that's, come out. That's crazy that someone's making a video being like, I got a real dual disc. Like, like it's some kind of ancient artifact. <laughs> Whereas I just had one as a kid and I'm like, fuck. <laughs> oh, what I loved so was the little cool. section uh, above the graveyard. where you, yeah, where you could like put your actual deck inside of it and you could pull it out. Was, yeah, and there's the graveyard was at the bottom graveyard. and then yeah. the, your life points were yeah. there. It was oh, such yeah. a cool, so, such a fucking cool piece of equipment. What a fucking genius. God, I design. wish that Yu Gi Oh came out when nerd culture was a bit more um, accepted because yeah, dual disc, unironically, one of the coolest things ever. I would love to see what a high, like high spec one. build. <laughs> There, an, an, actual, like, an actual, I'll, I'll an actual dual high disc. spec custom build of a dual disc would look like. Because obviously, this looks like you know. Can we all buy kids one toy. and play Yu-Gi-Oh with it? Sure. I, I really want to. I've do never that. played Yu-Gi-Oh before. I recently, oh, you want? You, I've it. never played Yu-Gi-Oh before. I, I've played Yu-Gi-Oh a few times in my in my life, but I've recently played the Forbidden Memories PS One game. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, which came out before the official rules of Yu-Gi-Oh mm. were established. And, yeah. Uh, I played it because there's a this they. It's like the craziest speed run of all time. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Because yeah. The, the game is fucked. It's they also made, RNG. Yeah, they right? made the game impossible. It's yeah. so yeah. fucking hard. Um, Isn't it like the the hundred percent record is like seventy something hours or something? Yeah, because you have to get like seven hundred cards, and some of the cards, oh, actually, a lot of the cards have zero point one drop rates. Yeah, yeah. So you have to just grind, <laughs> and it's like Konami was just hated kids. <laughs> but that was a fun game, a and I, it made me made me really want to play more Yu Gi Oh. Yeah, I totally. Thought, I just love yeah. Yu Gi Oh. It's so cool. The monster designs are just so cool. So cool. Yeah. I mean, of course, Attack on Titan is on there as well. Yeah. Uh, I saw his video where he did very much enjoy the ending. Uh, on the same, I, I mean, I think Charlie puts it on the same level as Code Geass now, just as a whole, Damn. as right. his like favorite anime. Uh, DBZ, he obviously grew up with, I assume. Yes. Mm. Same with like uh, Death Note, I would assume. Vinland Saga, yeah, I mean, who fucking doesn't like, it? like Hunter Hunter, Vinland Saga, like who doesn't like it? Uh, Jujutsu Kaisen, I'm not surprised. Not surprised. I think it's, if you're watching Jujutsu Kaisen right now, well, I guess- With season when, two? Well, when this is, when this is out, it's finished airing, but mm, there's yeah. like two weeks, two episodes left before. Mm. It's so hard not to think that it's like uh, fucking amazing. I just all like, it's the only anime I really want to keep watching every week. It's like the latest Shibuya arc has just been that modern yeah. shonen arc classic, insane. in my opinion. Insane. It's insane. People are going to be talking about this arc for generations to come. So that doesn't surprise me, but yeah. It's this is this is it. This is the boys only club. You know, this is sometimes my I don't know if your guys' Twitter feed has been just taken over by Shonen fans recently. I think it's because Jujutsu uh, Kaisen. Thankfully is, not. Is it not? No. Nah. Every day I log onto my Twitter and someone is making a certain thread of like, oh, here are some manga panels that go hard. Oh, oh I've seen those. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> manga panels that go hard on and shit like that. And it's the same fucking 10 shows. It's it's like- yep. <laughs> They might what? throw in Dan to Dan every now and then. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, there was just like out of nowhere incest scene in Jujutsu Kaisen recently. And that kind of blew up. <laughs> and I, I remember when I watched it, I was like, Huh? <laughs> <laughs> they kept that in? They kept that in? Yeah, there was just a random incest part that kind of came out of nowhere. Yeah. <laughs> it was really weird. It literally came out of nowhere. God, not they even just like- the Kaisen's safe. Yeah, and, and, it, and it, it was really funny watching Twitter react because they were like, it was like a bunch of like all the, because there was this one tweet that blew up that was like, ain't no way they put this in the anime. And it was just yeah. showing off incest, not, but, but even more concerning incest with like a really older, Sister and a very young brother. Oh, switching and they're up, actually, I see. And they're actually blood related. And they're blood well. related. Oh. They're, they're, it's, it's none of this they're, like step sibling bullshit. They're fully committing. And it was just out of nowhere <laughs> in the middle of like the most hyped shit ever. And they were like incest. You're like, fucking what? Jesus Christ. And then all the replies were like Vegeta with like bloodshot eyes, like <laughs> screaming, being like, why is she so bad though? <laughs> 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 And it's like, what is wrong with Twitter? <laughs> it was like literally like Vegeta coughing up blood being like, I don't care though, I would. <laughs> and it's like, what is wrong with Twitter? Like, what have we, what have we done? What have we done to these oh, people? It's, it's so amazing how like DBZ is just one of those shows where every non DBZ anime fan just loves to clown on that community, but Fuck me, they make they still make some of the best goddamn memes and reaction images. Honestly, of like after Twitter. modern shonen, I'm like maybe maybe we were too maybe we were too harsh on DBC fans. Well, I think it's because Goku and Vegeta have such rec like they're so recognizable, which lends to their memeability. 
Mm. In the same I, way I, that like Mario and Sonic are often memed because they're sure. so widely yeah. recognized. Yeah, totally. yeah. I'm just I'm just liking the fact that there are more anime screenshots that are just becoming widespread memes mm -hmm. now. Mm -hmm. Like I, I, the one I've seen recently that's been spread around is the one where like Gon's about to go for the attack yeah. and Killua just like got his hand on the shoulder, <laughs> which is like normally used when someone's like overshooting a tweet or someone's like <laughs> someone's like saying something that might have been going a little bit too far and someone just replies that and I'm that's like, so good, like that's so fucking good. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god yeah um I mean there's not much else to say about this one. Good taste, Charlie. I mean, Charlie, this is just good taste. We know this is good taste. It's just and like your, your bro comes to you who is like, hey, I want to get into anime. Welcome to the starter pack. Yeah. 